Hello. Hello. May I get a cup of water? I'd like to see my doctor. Voice is something that people don't realize the gravity it has. Being able to speak during one of the sickest moments of your life is a devastating handicap. It has an implication on your social, physical, mental well-being. Lyra is a small startup that was founded by some graduate and professional students here at UNC. And our aim is to improve the communication of patients that have been rendered voiceless or mute. Imagine you've uh, had to undergo a procedure and now you're not able to speak. These patients, when compared to speaking individuals, they face a three times higher adverse event rate in a hospital. At Lyra, we're we're developing video to speech enabled technology. Instead of being forced to write, draw, and gesture, we're looking to restore a more natural form of communication by allowing uh, an application to read their lips. I want to see the nurse. Vera's main focus right now is driving our Lip Train campaign. So, through Lip Train, we're looking for volunteers anywhere. Um, at any time to help participate in providing some of the training data we need to build our algorithm. My hopes for the future for Lyra are for Lyra to be in every hospital in the U.S. so that no patient is felt silenced by their needed medical treatment. What we're really looking to solve is that initial critical period of voicelessness. When somebody first wakes up realizing they can't speak and helping them overcome that critical moment in their lives.